G'day guys, my name is Harry Gill. I'm the owner of Greenwood Auto and Toys. This is my 1979 VJ40. Got a 4.5 litre V8 uh, diesel engine from a VDJ79 Toyota. Uh, it's got a all coil over front and rear. The front suspension is like Tubison shocks and the springs. Uh, the rear suspension is all custom made, designed and manufactured by us. Um, all the work was done in house uh, by myself and my brother. So we designed the front bar, rear bar, all the fender in-house, you know, the AutoCAD. So we got it laser cut and we fabricated in the shop. Uh, we had to convert the chassis to suit the new engine. So the four and a half liter engine is really wide and the transmission is very long. Lots of trial and error. We always wanted to have a 40, because um, that's an iconic Toyota. We always loved that design. So one day we were just sitting together with my brother and then we decided to, you know, build something different. And then we did come up with the idea of, uh, you know, converting it to 4.5 liter diesel engine. But everyone was saying like, it's, it's too hard, you know. Um, it can't be done, never been done before. So we took it as a challenge. We wanted to keep the shape original. So if you look on the car, it looks all standard from outside, but inside it's all new. You know, new engine uh, from a 2011 79 series. Disc brakes all around, front and rear. Really happy with the final results. Me and my brother are rev heads, so we always wanted to have a, like a ma maximum power we can achieve. Uh, so that's why we went with the Toyota engine, one of the best engine available at the moment. And, and we wanted to keep it as a like old Toyota, uh, running gear and the body. Uh, all we did is a tune it. So at the moment it's got a uh, 216 rear wheel horsepower, uh, like 550 newton meter torque. Really fun to drive. Um, plenty of power, um, love the sand, it goes, yeah, it goes well. From front grille all the way to the back, it's all standard BJ40 body. So we haven't touched any firewall and we haven't modified the front grille. So we just put the engine in between that space. So it was a mission, but we got it in. And then Harry said we want the air conditioning in the car. So we had to manage another 20 mil in the front to put the air con condenser in the front. So we did that. It's all like custom made wiring from the VDJ 79 series to suit that motor because they are computer controlled. And the gauge cluster is also from the VDJ 79. It's really fun to drive. It's, it's, it's more comfortable compared to the previous suspension. It's like more stable on the road, especially on the, on the, if you drive on a freeway on 100 k it's, it's very like, smooth and stable. And uh, it's, it's, it's fun to drive. Plenty of torque, so you can, you can drive in fifth gear from the 50 kilometer all the way up. You just put a foot down, it goes straight up. I want to say a special thanks to Mike Dempster and Jack Furzer who always give us encouragement sometime like every day. Yeah?